Hi, and welcome to Omnitas How To Series with Monday.com. I'm Frederick Castanon. Today, let's talk about permissions. So, Monday has a number of ways to set up your permissions. Today, let's talk about the overarching permissions. Let's have a look at my screen. What we need to do is go into the admin panel. So if you're not an admin, this is not gonna be uh, available to you. Click your avatar down in the furthest left corner. Go to admin and go to permissions. Here we can see what type of permissions we have. Anything from files being uploaded to who can create main boards, private boards, and so on, so on, so on. We can also see that we have drop down lists within this list, example for the integrations. So we can have specific permissions for specific native integrations. For example, to Adobe Creative Cloud or Eventbrite or Facebook or whatever. So here you can actually have differences between the different integrations. This is the first place you want to have a look at. The second part, let's go back to one of our boards. The second part is on a board level. That we find in the top right corner in the main section or the main menu of that board. Click that and we have board permissions. As you can see now, my demo account is actually a pro account, so I don't have this feature. But if you're an enterprise user, you can set permissions on who can view what items and only view uh, items that they are assigned to. Otherwise, we have our edit permissions down below. Now I've set any, anyone can edit anything, including the structure of the board. Or I can change it to only board owners can edit the structure. Everyone else can do only edit the information. So this is the next step. And that's on a column level. So again, let's look at my screen. What I do is I go to the column menu, that's the little arrow up here, and I go to settings. And we can see here that I can restrict the possibility to edit information within a column, or I can actually hide the column altogether. This means that only the people I allow will now be able to see this or edit this. And it's as easy as click. Now only I can edit this uh, column, but I can here also invite someone else. This also works for guests and members alike, so you can use it however you feel. So if you want to have different permissions for board members or members in your account versus guests in your account, this is how you can set it up. Best of luck. Thanks for watching. Bye.